Hey everyone, happy Monday. Freddie Miller here, really fired up, excited. Hope you guys are doing great. Wanted to come uh, as uh, as promised last night, uh, live on video. I'm sure I'll get a lot of people joining me live and then uh, also get some people joining me uh, for the replay after. Hopefully the, the, the bandwidth is good and you guys can, um, can see me uh, and hear me. I saw yesterday it was a little choppy, so the data wasn't that great, but uh, Hope you guys are doing great. Hope you guys are ready for a phenomenal week. I know uh, we got a little speed bump with uh, Independence Day tomorrow here in the United States. And uh, I know a lot of people are on vacation. A lot of people are with their family and whatnot. Uh, hope you guys are doing great. Let me see uh, real quick as I set this up. What's going on here? No, I don't see it there. Anyhow, hope you guys are doing great. Um, not going to be a long message, but definitely wanted to get on and and uh, maybe uh, share some wisdom, some, uh, some stuff that um, you know, I've, I've uh, experienced just in the last 24 hours that's really powerful. And um, so anyhow, I hope you guys are doing great. But the uh, topic today I shared with you guys is a lot more blessed uh, to give than to receive. And you know, uh, it's biblical, but um, I kind of want to elaborate a little bit of, of what I meant or what I mean by that, uh, really, because I think that you know, I firmly believe you, you've got to obviously get before you uh, receive, right? You got to, uh, I don't know, you, you know, you, in anything in life, you know, you know, you, you're paid in relation to the services rendered, right? Whatever it is that you do in life, uh, you know, if, if, you, if you work at a job, you know, if, if you put in your hours, you're going to get money. If you're in sales, if you make some sales, you're going to make some commissions. Obviously, uh, if you have something to sell, people are going to buy from you. Um, obviously, if, if you give them some value, right? If you give them something, you're, you're obviously going to receive, right? And um, But once you get that knocked out of the way, right? Once you get everything going um, and you're able to give back, you know, uh, maybe a term that, that I, I learned a long time ago and, and called prompting, right? Every time something goes into your heart, any, any time something crosses and you feel that gut to do something about it, right? To, to give, it doesn't necessarily have to be monetarily, but you know, that you're able to give back. You know, there's, there's, a, there's a certain sense of, of um, gratification, if you will, that you get um, when you do that. And you know, one thing I've learned through life is that, you know, you definitely wanna always be a giver because eventually, you know, as you give to others, uh, others will give to you and yours, you know, when, when in times of needs. And guys, we all go through ups and downs in life. Um, anything can happen, you know, life can change at a flip of a switch, right, like that for anyone at any time. I don't care how old you are, how healthy you are, uh, or not healthy or whatnot. And so anyhow, my message for you guys really is always look for opportunities to give, you know. Um, you know, social media, you, you see people, uh, you know, just um, every now and then when, when you're looking through, people, people are struggling out there. And, um, you know, people aren't necessarily asking, but sometimes you gotta find it within you, uh, you know, to share, to, to, to give back and connect. And uh, so anyhow, I, I get a lot of pleasure out of that. I do it a lot. A lot of times it's anonymous, <laughs> um, you know, and um, most of the times I just don't care for any uh, recognition or anything like that. But it just gives me peace of mind. I feel good. I feel uh, like I made a difference in someone else's life. And uh, for every mess up I do, <laughs> it covers up, I guess, is one way of thinking about it. But anyhow, uh, really what I want to share with you guys is, you know, that look for opportunities uh, to give back. You know, like I said, it doesn't necessarily have to be money. It could be time. It could be advice. You know, people are, are hurting. It could be from a relationship issue, from financial issues, uh, from health issues. Um, and you name it. You know, I've been through all of them in the last year. But um, you know, people people are are, are searching, are, are seeking for a friend, are seeking for someone uh, to give them some positive reinforcements, to direct them in the right way. And you know, if you ever see a, an opportunity. Uh, my my call for you guys today is uh, definitely to, to give back, to, to be that person, to be that person that is that light, to be that person that, that you know, is that guardian angel, if you will, for that person that, that's maybe seeking, that's searching, that's praying, that's hurting. And um, you never know. Uh, as you go through your cycles of life, like all of us do, uh, maybe uh, it'll come back tenfold. Uh, you don't do it for that reason, but it, stuff happens. So, and I hope you guys are doing great. I uh, hope you guys have a, a great rest of the day. I'm going to go in Spanish after this. So if you don't speak Spanish, don't worry about it. But um, uh, my message to you guys is, uh, you know, uh, find those opportunities. They're out there and uh, it's very gratifying. And, um, uh, you know, I'm a big believer in, um, in the golden rule, doing to others. I'll leave it there. Take care of it, guys. Fred, sir, peace out. See ya. Have a great, happy fourth. See you tomorrow. I'll definitely come up tomorrow fired up. 
excited. I won't be in this place where I can't make too much noise. I'll be going nuts. <laughs> Later, guys. Take care.